Hello, my name is Cornelius Kölbel, and I want to show you a new feature of Privacy Idea 2.19. This new feature is an additional tool, the Privacy Idea Token Janitor. So, what does the Privacy Idea Token Janitor do? You can use the Token Janitor to manage and clean up and uh, foster your sets of tokens. Imagine you have a lot of users, you have a lot of tokens, and you might get a bit um, confused or you may lose sight. What kind of tokens are there? Users enroll tokens and um, tokens are not used anymore or users leave your company but the token is still in the privacy idea system, which results in so-called orphaned tokens, um, where the token is still assigned to a user, but the user does not exist in the user store anymore. So let's take a look at the token janitor. The token janitor can find tokens and you can specify by which parameter you want to find the token. For example, by a serial number, by a token type, or is the token orphaned or not, or is the token active, is the token assigned, or when was the token last used. So for example, you can also find tokens which were not used for the last two months or something like this. So let's directly dive in. I will find a token. Wait a second. I will avoid the lockout and simply filter for the HOTP token. <clears throat> I will simply find tokens by token type and also find the HOTP token. This was simple, wasn't it? Now, these are all tokens which calculate according to the um, HOTP algorithm. Um, these are smartphone tokens, and this, for example, is a YubiKey. This is a hardware device. So if I only want to find um, smartphone tokens, I can also filter for the um, serial number. Here you see. And um, imagine you have a lot of tokens, but some tokens are not assigned. And um, to avoid the misuse of these non-assigned tokens, you want to disable these non-assigned tokens. So let's also find not assigned tokens. Assigned is false. And we found one not assigned token and we want to disable this token. You see, um, we have some different options here. And first we will disable this token. Okay, we disabled this token, 870, this token here. This is now disabled and you can also see this token is not assigned. Well, <clears throat> um, looking at this overview here in the web UI, you may say, wait a second, there's another OATH token, HOTP type, which is not assigned. Well, it looks like as it is not assigned, but you see it is assigned to a user which does not exist anymore. And this is why the resolver cannot resolve the user ID to a username. This is what we call an orphaned token. And this can happen, as I mentioned initially, when user, a user leaves the company and the token is not revoked. So let's find an orphaned token. Well, we find all orphaned tokens. Find orphaned. <clears throat> we find one orphaned token 
And um, we would not want to delete often hardware tokens because we would have to import the hardware tokens again. So um, we also filter for the token type. And now we will do the action delete. So now we deleted this orphaned token here. Um, as you can see, this token does not exist anymore. Fine. Um, so we might also disable hardware tokens which are not used, for example. Um, so let's find hardware tokens, which are not assigned. And let's, oh, okay, I think we already disabled. We will use a new action. We will use the action mark, which means we do some nice settings here. Let's see what we can do. Um, we will set a new token or we will set a new um, token info field. The interesting thing here is you can set any kind of token info field, which you can use for your own workflows. Um, and we might set enrollment state and we set the token info value to needs to be shipped okay so let's take a look at this token at the token info and we see well, here we see that we set this token info field, which we now can use for our own workflows. So I hope you like the new possibility to manage your tokens and to integrate this into your workflows. Use the new token janitor. I'm looking forward to your feedback. Stay tuned and subscribe. Thank you for watching.